Good、uh, afternoon, everyone. This is Katz from Yokoso News, yokosonews.com. Yokoso News is the online website to introduce Japan in English so that you can understand Japan more.、Uh, usually, Yokoso News is providing the、uh, fun stuff about Japanese culture in English. However, since the March 11th earthquake, I've been I've switched some of my regular programming to introduce a weekly update. Used to be a daily, but the weekly update of what's going on in Japan from those disasters、uh, earthquake, tsunami, and Fukushima nuclear power plant. Yokoso News wants to、uh, aim to provide the information that you wouldn't normally hear. From、uh, mainstream English media. So, our information tends to be a little bit minor, but uh, uh, because I, I will not cover the, what the major English media mainly talks about because you, you would hear them anyway. So, here we go. Music by Kevin McLeod. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching, everyone. But before I go into this week's, a,、uh, this week's uh, update, I'm going to have an announcement. Our next live cast is coming on July 3rd, Japan Times,、uh, in Japan Standard Time, July 3rd, Sunday at 2 p.m. A day before 4th of July.、Um, music for Charity live cast from Kawasaki, Japan, which is right next to Tokyo. I will be emceeing and I will be live casting. Although I have a little bit worry about their network, but、uh, you will be able to enjoy. The charity concert、uh, from all the、uh, uh, older mix of the independent musicians around the Tokyo. So, uh, uh, this is the first time that I'm gonna try to do because,、uh, as you know,、uh, it's, it's, it's,、uh, it's going to、uh, cost something to keep doing this emergency broadcast. And also, I want to support. Uh, these musicians' effort, uh, especially uh, April Parkinson. So,、uh, but because、uh, I've been doing this emergency broadcast mainly, so I kind of sort of、uh, kind of sort of running out of my fund. <laughs> so,、uh, I kind of need to ask for the donation. To support for my effort, and you know, then you, you can enjoy the music. And also, I this is going to be funded for me to be able to go visit North Japan and stuff too. So, if so, folks, if you like,、uh, watch our live cast, it will be archived as well. Watch our live cast. And if you like what we do, please donate.、Uh, I added the donate button on yokosonews.tv too. So、uh, if you have any question, you can also ask us a question as well. All right, so that's the update. And I will be in Tokyo next this weekend starting. Friday, actually. Today it's Wednesday now. So it's in two days. Yeah, I will be in Tokyo. So maybe I will be tweet casting. Hey, so、uh, first of all, Zen, Risa,、um, Machiavel, 
uh, search me on it. Uh, what's up? Thank you for watching today's show. So, let's do a weekly update in between June 21st and June 29th.、Um, uh, actually, it's pretty much June 28th. So,、uh, let's start from food safety because food safety is important to everybody. So, according to the、uh, Japanese government, they lifted the shipping restriction of the spinach and kabu in Fukushima Prefecture. So,、uh, uh, they have Lifted all vegetable leaf vegetable shipping restriction from Fukushima nuclear power,、uh, Fukushima prefecture on June 23rd.、Uh, the, but the shiitake mushroom, plum, and bamboo roots, their shipping restriction are still in place. However, the vegetables,、uh, shipping restriction,、uh, like leaves, vegetable, s those shipping restrictions h a s been lifted on June 23rd, according to the Japanese government. So,、uh, however, Ayu fish. A、uh, Ayu fish, what's the、uh, what's their Japanese English name? Ayu fish, Ayu fish, they 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 uh they added the shipping restriction because they detected the more amount of、uh, radiation. Yeah, are you fish? They detected about a、uh, 4,400 becquerel of the、uh, cesium from Nitagawa, Fukushima, and 3,300 becquerel from Manogawa, Fukushima on June 24th. Oh, also the Abukuma, from the Abukuma River. They found about 1260 becquerel of the cesium on June 26th. And when, yeah, so they added on June 20, on June 27th, according to Japanese government. Because they detected a、uh, little bit higher amount of the uh, uh, cesium from the IU fish, they added the uh, sh- uh, shipping restriction of the Fukushima IU fish. At the same time,、um, uh, Japanese government also uh, uh, Issue the shipping restriction of the green tea from Nakaimachi Kanagawa. And so、uh, now, total 10 districts of the green tea also have the shipping list restriction too. And however,、uh, so, so、uh, green tea, fish, And some of the vegetables are the primary concern of the food contamination at this moment.、Uh, but on June 29th, according to Kanagawa Prefecture, a,、uh, one region, Kaiseicho,、uh, they, the green tea from Kaiseicho, from Kanagawa Prefecture, they only found 90 becquerel per kilogram of the cesium. So, from the Aracha green tea. So, some of the、uh, green tea s t a r t getting the lower radiation contamination than 500 becquerel per kilogram, which they said that the Japanese government said, according to Japanese government, it's safe. 
But you know, of course, the、um, you know concern is main concern is the guardian of especially your kids. So、uh, according to、uh, Yomi Uri, on June twenty ninth, Kyoto, city of Kyoto, said that they will be disclosing the、uh, test result of the radiation check of the vegetables. That they are using for school cafeteria, school lunch. So,、uh, some education you know, institute are trying to、uh, meet the、uh, demand of the guardians who want s to know the food safety for their kids. And then on June, a,、uh, the, the, the June 20th, my. Slow. On June 20th,、uh, they have Japanese、uh, parliament pass the bill.、Uh, it's called Fuko Kihonho in Japanese.、Uh, maybe in English it says the reconstruction bill, something basic. Reconstruction bill or something that i n c l u d e they are going to launch reconstruction agency. So, what、uh, they will go i n g to assign the commissioner of the reconstruction. So, it is it is going to be inter agency,、uh, like between like. Uh, Depart e m Ministry of Land, Ministry of、uh, Fishery, Ministry of all kinds of、uh, a- government a g e n c y so that they can speed up the process of the reconstruction. So uh, uh, that's the、uh, Fuko、uh, Reconstruction Agency is going to launch because the bill has passed on June 20th. And then、uh, two days ago,、uh, Naoto Kan assigned a、uh, the commissioner of the uh, uh, commissioner of the、uh, reconstruction agency. What is his name? Matsuda-san? But anyway, but the political,、uh, political conflict is still going on in Japan. Uh, many uh, many uh, parliament members, house members, including within DPJ, they are very stressed that Naoto Kan is just trying to keep the、uh, prime minister's seat even after he said he was going to resign. He, ha- he hasn't mentioned exactly when to resign yet. So,、uh, frustration raised in- inside of the parliament house member. However, many Japanese people are kind of tired of a,、uh, those、uh, political stuff. NHK and all other TV media interview, you know, interview the local people. And then those people are kind of tired of the, uh, those uh, political f i g h t And they just wanted to keep moving forward with the reconstruction. But at the same time, the politicians are、uh, feeling a little bit urgent that、uh, Naoto Kan doesn't have the leadership to, to execute the uh, faster um, reconstruction effort. Uh, many many、uh, politicians believe that Naoto Kan is slow, so he needs to resign. So, so、uh, you know, it, it is,、uh, they are having uh, those uh, political turmoil right now. But I'm going to kind of skip it. Too much. Not that much. And when. So, according to Yomi Uri, on June 20th, a、uh, many b e a c h in Kanto area, around Tokyo area, are worried and suffering about the、uh, decline of all the b e a c h g o e r s this year. 
So uh, Yomiuri interview a uh, people of the you know the the beach store owners and to tourism association and stuff. The hotel owners about their concern about beach decline of the beach goers、uh, because you know they they、um, they worry you know they, of course many people are concerned about the radiation radioactive contamination of the ocean and stuff and Yomiuri、uh, on June twenty seconds Yomiuri has reported the.、Uh, Effort of、uh, Fukushima University that、uh, they are trying, they are going to launch internet、uh, TV conference counseling service to take to treat the people who people who who are suffering from PTSD. So、uh, Fukushima University is a、uh, huge. Hu- hu- Uh, humani- humanity department,、uh, the teacher Nagae san,、uh, he's,、uh, he's also his major in the psych- psychiatrics, and he said that he is going to use Skype. and He was researching the way to use the Skype to use for their counseling. So, in, in addition to a Twitter. So, according to Fukushima University,、uh, they will take a session once a week for 40 minutes, maximum 12 times. You can get the free counseling.、Uh, you need to have a laptop, web camera,、uh, you know. Uh, uh, yes. At first, they will take a phone counseling and then、uh, they will send you, or they need to set up the web camera and mic, and they proceed with the、uh, Skype counseling service. So, the effort of Tukushima University reported by Yomiuri. And then, also on June 22nd, A special bill about finance, you know, it's called Kaisei Kinyu Kino Kyoka Ho. It's the bill to uh, uh, kind of support the small business owner who.、Um, uh, uh, it's the bill to support the mutual fund of the local North Japan mutual fund. Uh, who were damaged by that thing? So, so on June 22nd, the Japanese government passed the uh, special uh, f- uh, bill for the mutual fund to support the、uh, um, those loan damages for the mutual fund. And on June 22nd, A、uh, self defense has deployed the first for、uh, the self defense had been deploying the res- reserve、uh, self defense personnel. This is the first time in the self defense history that they call the reserved self defense personnel. But、uh, on June 22nd, they Those reserve、uh, self defense personnel m i s s i o n h a s completed, according to Yomiuri. So,、uh, this is the first time that uh, self, uh, since the formation of the self defense in 1954,、uh, you know, so this disaster was really big. So,、uh, about 469 reserve self defense. Uh, member were called and then they were, you know, doing their service until now, until June 2 2 s So、uh, then, according to NHK and、uh, Yomiuri and other staff,、uh, many fishermen start、uh, resuming their work 
for example, yesterday, I think yesterday, the Bonito's、uh, market has resumed in Kesen Numa Miyagi.、Uh, then also on June 22nd, Siomiuri reported that、uh, oyster fishing, fishermen start rebuilding the o- oyster,、um, oyster farm in the bay. So. Then, according to a Japanese government, they said that they are planning to、uh, assign the North Japan as a special district to support the、uh, fishermen. That i n c l u d e actually, this is the、uh, some of you may not know, corporation could not join fishing. Only a personal fisherman were kind of allowed to fish on nearby ocean. There are a company who owns the、uh, big fish to travel like thousand kilometers to fish like、uh, tuna and stuff,、uh, long distance fishing. However, nearby fishing,、uh, they know. Uh, no corporation were allowed uh, to, uh, to uh, d- go fish nearby. A, um, uh, f- no corporation were able to obtain the fishing rights. However, Japanese government are planning to let the corporation to uh, uh, be able to、uh, have the rights, fishing rights. So that you know, we can use those、uh, corporations' the fund to, uh, to, uh, to be able to use it to help, revi- help speed up the revive the uh, uh, you know, stuff. And on June 23rd, Lady Gaga came to Japan. She performed at the MTV charity concert last weekend. But before and after, Lady Gaga came and then held a press conference and she showed the support to the、uh, Japanese people. And then, you know, he, she helped us. A, uh, uh, you know, promote Japan. Promote Japan is safe and stuff, and encourage people to come visit. And when,、uh, according to Japan Olympic Committee,、uh, they, they are planning to organize a mini Olympic in August or September. And they're also planning to invite some athletes from the United States.、Uh, the, the United States Olympic Committee has an offer to send their athletes to this mini Olympic in August, September. So, Olymp- this mini Olympic is organized by、Jap- Japan Olympic Committee. And then, you know, to, to help, you know, you know, to cheer up the people of North. So,、uh, chairman of、uh, Japan Olympic Com- Committee, Takeda san, said by, ho- by holding these o- mini Olympics,、uh, we, we want from small kids to elderly to attend the event and then、uh, refresh by exercising. According to Japanese government, Japanese cabinet, on June 24th,、uh, the total amount of the damage, estimated damage, is accumulated probably to a、uh, one billion, ten billion, hundred, sixteen point nine trillion yen. So,、uh, according to Japanese government, Japanese cabinet member. So,、uh, 
、uh, most amount of the loss was the housing、uh, factory, all those construction damage, which is, ten, which is 10.4 trillion yen. And the infrastructure damage, such as road, river, uh, uh, port, which is the 2.2 trillion yen. The lifeline damage it was, accumul- it was, was about、uh, 1.3 trillion yen. Farming, a、uh, fishery industry loss, was 1.9 trillion yen. Other damage, such as school or hospital, 1.1 trillion yen. So the total of 16.9 trillion yen has been their estimated damage.、Uh, to the comparison, in 1995 Hanshin earthquake, their loss was 9.6 trillion yen. So,、um, this、um, 311 earth, tsunami earthquake disaster is almost, almost、uh, twice as much as scale as the Hanshin earthquake. According to the Japanese cabinet,、uh, this is just an estimate. Uh, it could increase, it could change lower or higher in the future. But as right now, it's 16, Japanese government s a y it's 16.9 trillion yen. And then, according to Fukushima Prefecture,、uh, they are planning to give out 1 million yen to the、uh, kids who became orphaned. By this,、uh, this disaster. If,、uh, so, if you lose, if the、uh, kids lose both sides of the parents, mother and dad, they will receive 1 million yen. If one of the dad or mom uh, uh, went, uh, were killed or went missing, the orphan will be receiving half a million yen. Uh, which is about 10,000 yen, 10,000 US dollar, and then 50,000 US. Would you mind? No, 5,000 to, yeah, about 4, 6,000 US dollar for the、uh, one who lost one side of the parents. And then if you lose the both s i d e of the parents, Uh, they, will, they are entitled to receive uh, uh, 12,000 US dollar or 1 million, U, 1 million Japanese yen.、Uh, this is the、uh, Fukushima Prefecture's、uh, its original plan to support the orphanage. This, this, oh, this money is coming from your donation from the Red Cross and the Community Chest of Japan. So, the,、uh, your donation、uh, to the Red Cross is now part of the donation. Fukushima Prefecture said, decided to use a donation to the Red Cross to give to the orphanage of the Fukushima. Okay, Tracy, thank you for, thank you for converting、uh, 21 billion US dollars. The last、uh, damage, total amount of damage. And then. So, as you know, it, we, are ha- we are in the rainy season. Uh, it's hot right now, but maybe rainy season is almost over in Japan. However,、uh, rainy season has entered in North Japan, and then those temporary housing already start suffering from the leak, rain, you know, leakage from the rain, and also the ant、uh, 
start coming into the、um, temporary housing and start making some damages. So、uh, maybe some malfunction, temporary housing stuff start recognizing in Japan as well. Kind of similar stuff I heard from Katrina, but. And then, according to Yomiuri, a、uh, it, Yomiuri、uh, newspaper, its own research. At least 14 hospitals in Miyagi、uh, and Iwate Prefecture they,、uh, they, uh, they lost the patient's information. So they were in the, sometimes they were having a hard time to uh, um, proceed the diagnosis and stuff. Many patients didn't know what kind of medicine they were taking, especially elderly. Especially elderly patients, they didn't know what kind of medicine they were taking. So uh, uh, it's, you know,、um, but Yomiuri also introduced that some of the hospitals were using the,、uh, record, were recording the patient's information electrically. So, some of them are backing up in a remote area, so they were able to、uh, retrieve it. But many hospitals weren't using electrical in, you know, information s y s t e m so many patients were kind of having a hard time to get treated in the right way after the disaster. So, according to Yomiuri,、uh, Yomiuri's newspaper, In North Japan, Tohoku area, Iwate, Miyagi, Fukushima, there are about 64 major b e a c h However,、uh, only two out of 64 b e a c h confirmed that they are going to open. Especially in Fukushima Prefecture, all 16 b e a c h in Fukushima Prefecture is going to be closed this summer. And many、uh, the b e a c h in Iwate Miyagi, which are far away from Fukushima nuclear power plant,、uh, but they still had to work to remove the debris from the beach. Still dangerous. You know, people start walking on the barefoot on the beach, but if you have a debris, you get hurt, you get injured, so you, they need to clean up. You know, many、uh, tourism agencies, the local government are trying to clean up the beach as soon as possible and trying to uh, uh, resume. It's getting hot. So,、uh... Accor- then next, according to Ashinaga Ikuekai, Ashinaga Ikuekai is the non profit group to support. The, the orphans,、uh, Ashinaga. According to Ashinaga, on June 27th,、uh, there are about 1,100 kids who lost one or both parents, and 40% of them are younger than、uh, elementary kids or younger. Then, among those 1100 kids, they, 60% of those 1100 kids they lost their father, who are the source of the main income. So,、uh, because、uh, 60% of these、uh, 1100 kids lost the father, who is the main source of the income. And 40% of them are still in the elementary school or younger. So,、uh, according to Ashinaga, they need more support. They need、uh, long term support to be able to bring these kids up until they g- finish the high school. So, uh, uh, So,、uh, according to Ashinaga, 
346 kids are the uh, elementary school. 137 are preschool. Middle high school are 242. High school are 242 kids who lost the uh, parents, either or both sides of the parents, from this disaster. On June 27th, according to NHK, a uh... oh, this is same same news. On June 23rd, uh, according to NHK, the first international flight from Sendai Airport has left since the disaster so it it was a charter flight from the Spain uh, but uh, it was a charter flight it wasn't the regular flight however this is the first step that the Sendai airport resumed the international service All right, now we are going to move to the uh, Fukushima nuclear power plant related stuff. So there are two, three concerns among Japanese and Japanese media. One is the ocean contamination. Other is the, uh, the contamination of the land and food safety, especially for their kids. And of course, the Fukushima nuclear power plant situation of the Fukushima nuclear power plant itself. And also, uh, energy consumption about whether to keep having the nuclear power plant or not. So that's this week's update of the Fukushima nuclear power plant. First, bonitos. According to the uh, uh, fishery agency on June 5th, uh, June 21st according to uh, uh, fishery ag- Sui Sancho what's Sui Sancho in Japanese official official title of Sui Sancho yeah fisheries agency of Japan uh, they have been researching the bonito offshore of the Fukushima nuclear power plant so uh, because the uh, the radioactive contaminated level of the bonito uh, which are located at 530 kilometers east from Fukushima nuclear power plant has went below the shipping restriction. So fishery agency of Japan are now allowing the fishermen to take bonitos from 500 kilometers offshore of Fukushima. Uh, So according to fishery agency, they check the bonito on June 15th the cesium they detected was 5.5 becquerel per kilogram. According to Japanese uh, safety standard, 500 becquerel per kilogram is the, uh, sh- they have a shipping restriction. However, 5.5 becquerel per kilogram is one hundredth of their restriction. So they consider it safe. So they resume fishing. According to, uh, uh, according to NHK, the bonito fishermen start fishing and bonito start coming up to the uh, market uh, yesterday. So So next, main concern about the Fukushima nuclear power plant is the water filtering system 
on site of the Fukushima nuclear power plant. So, as you know, a um, uh, because uh, they've been pumping the water into the uh, nuclear reactor to keep cooling down the uh, fuel rod, melted fuel rod inside of the nuclear reactor. Uh, they have. They have more and more radioactive contaminated water on site of the Fukushima nuclear power plant, and it's already leaked onto the ocean. But、um, they need to remove those,、uh, they need to minimize the leakage to the ocean, and they need to uh, uh, clean up the,、uh, those、uh, contaminated water. Which are still on site of Fukushima nuclear power plant. So,、uh, TEFCO has asked multi international companies, including Areva from the France,、uh, some US company, Toshiba, Mitsu,、uh, Hitachi, a、uh, Japanese、uh, company, to build a、uh, water filtering system which cost about 50 billion Japanese yen, which is about 600 like, million US dollar or something. So, by doing this, that they can reduce the number of the radioactive contaminated water. They can reuse the water to cool down the、uh, reactor again. And then they can minimize the leakage of the.、Uh, um, The radioactive contaminated water to the ocean. However,、uh, since the test trial, they've been having trouble and it's been kind of almost two weeks, but、uh, we'll go get to that. So,、uh, according to a、uh, Yomiuri newspaper, In Kanagawa Prefecture, they have found a、uh, kind of high amount of the cesium from the green tea, from Ashiga, it's called Ashigaru green tea. And according to Yomiuri, their loss could accumulate it to 250 million yen, which is about 2.7 or 8. Million US dollar equivalent. So, according to、uh, Yomi, Yomi, according to、uh, Yomiuri, they did test, they, they did have, they did do the additional test of their leaves, green tea leaves. However,、uh, they did find a、um, As much, as much as 420 becquerel per kilogram of the cesium in it, but the number has lower than sipping restriction. Uh, so many farmers want to resume shipping the green tea, however. Uh, Kanagawa Prefecture's、uh, Green Tea Center still wants to restrict the shipping. So、uh, it, it's going to be the、uh, conflict between the tea farmers and the rest of the、uh, people. You know. So. So,、uh, you know, ship the pr water processing facility on Fukushima nuclear power plant is kind of have continue to have the human error or ma ma malfunction error. Like, for example, on June 23rd, a,、um, they forgot to close some of the vent in the water circulation system. So, that some of the monitor e meter wasn't functioning properly. So,、uh, they wanted to wonder what, what's going on. However, a,、uh, some of the sensor 
that detect the vent is closed or open was malfunctioning. So that's where that were the one of the problems. So they don't know why. Then, according to a、uh, Kyushu University and Tokyo University research team on June 22nd,、uh, some, they did the simulation. The team from Kyushu University and Tokyo University,、uh, from Tokyo University's、uh, Takemura uh, professor, associate professor Takemura,、uh, used the,、uh, some kind of simulation model,、uh, and then、uh, they, simul- they simulated the hydrogen blast. From the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. So, according to their research, on Ju- March 14th and 15th,、uh, because of the low pressure、uh, the region that passed the East Japan, the low pressure、uh, region b r i n g those uh, uh, re- some of the radiation up to five kilometers up. And those、uh, radiation went to the jet stream and it traveled 3,000 kilometers in one day. On March 17th, it,、uh, some of it arrived in the、uh, North Japan,、uh, nor- North America, West Coast. And it, went,、uh, it also went to Iceland. And on, by on March 23rd, it arrived in Switzerland. So that's what their simulation model of the,、uh, how Fukushima nuclear power plant's hydrogen、um, explosion uh, brought the,、uh, to the Europe.、Um, Yeah, but I think I think i t it's think it's a small amount, right? So, so、uh, second concern about the beach because it's kind of, it's, you know, the beach, it's getting summer, it's getting hot, everybody wants to go swim. I need to lose my weight to go to swim. Uh, I need to,、uh, but I want to eat curry too. Anyway, so、um, uh, according to Ministry of Environment, they have set the safety standard of、um, uh, beach. So if, if, the, if the beach has 50 becquerel per liter of cesium, Or 30 becquerel per liter of iodine.、Uh, that's then the beach has to close down. So, uh, um, uh, according to ministry, so they,、uh, yeah, so it, they made it much tighter. They made the restriction much tighter than drinking water restriction. For the cesium, drinking water restriction is 200 becquerel per liter. Iodine restriction level is 300 becquerel per liter. But for the beach, the, 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 rest, the level, restriction level, legal level, is 50 becquerel per liter of the cesium. 30 becquerel per liter of the iodine. So, but、uh, Ministry of Environment,、uh, they urge the uh, uh, beach, organi- beach uh, organizer to test the ocean at least once a month and then disclose it to the public. According to Ministry of、uh, Environment, by June 23rd, they have a、uh, 
they have conducted a research of the uh, of uh, of the beach radioactive contamination level from 135 beach from Shizuoka, Kanagawa, Ibaraki, and Fukushima. So, according to them, from Iwaki and Nago, two beach from Iwaki and Nago, they found 13 becquerel per kilogram of the cesium. However, the rest of 133 lo beach l o c a t i o n of Shizuoka, Kanagawa, Ibaraki, Fukushima, They did not find any radioactive contamination from those 133 b e a c h by June 23rd, according to, mini according to Ministry of the、uh, Environment that, who did the research. So, according to them, it should be safe. And according to Fukushima High School Association, On June, June 23rd, if、uh, they will, so it's getting summertime in Japan, high school baseball is the most popular, one of the most popular summer g a m e However, because of the threat of the radiation, according to High School Association of Fukushima, they said, Uh, they said that if the radiation level exceeds 3.8 microsievert per hour, they will cancel all the game of that day. So, they will, they, so、uh, they, before they start the game at 6 30 a.m., they will, they will measure. Uh, the radiation level from the five l o c a t i o n batter box,、uh, the bench, and stand behind the back net around the center position. So they are going to、uh, measure five,、uh, the they are going to read a, a reading of from follow the, the five l o c a t i o n And they will make a decision if they are going to conduct a baseball game of that day or not. And when. According to Japanese government, they said on June 23rd, they are going to conduct. Mass health research for next 30 years to uh, uh, conduct if、um, any of、um, to conduct the health check of all the people of Fukushima next 30 years to check the radiation damage and health check. So they are going to include the budget. 100 Uh, million, 100 billion Japanese yen, which is about 1 billion US,、uh, US dollar. To,、uh, then they are going to set up the fund, then they're going to use it to continue doing this、um, uh, research project. So, this.、Uh, Already, Fukushima Prefecture, the local government already decided to conduct the health check by themselves. However,、um, you know, Fukushima Prefecture local government does not have enough money, so Japanese government is going to help Fukushima Prefecture in, for the money to, to do the health check of the people of the Fukushima. Um, you know, according to this research, will be done because,、uh, you know, we actually don't know, even the experts don't really know what's the effect 
of being exposed to small amount of the radiation in long term that much. So, uh, um, uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah. we'll see. And then, according to Yomiuri, on June 23rd, Governor of Shizuoka Prefecture wanted to visit the uh, Ministry of uh, Health and Ministry of uh, Agriculture, Fishery and Marine. They wanted to uh, government uh, Governor of Shizuoka ask the safety uh, ask the ask the safety com uh, safety message from the. Uh, Minister, that the green tea are safe. So, okay. Anyway, um, so yeah, it's it's um, it's uh, yeah. Shizuoka governor of you know Shizuoka prefecture's main industry is the green tea. And then you know they they are supposed to be uh, so according to uh, you know Shizuoka gov sh the governor of Shizuoka wanted to go into Japanese government and they re they managed to they manage the minister of uh, health minister of uh, farm says that the uh, the green tea of Shizuoka are safe. Okay, that's the news. So on June 24th, uh, t according to TEPCO, uh, the remote helicopter uh, T Hawk uh, were measuring the radiation level on the top of the uh, second nuclear reactors building however they got the engine trouble so they had to land on the ceiling of the uh, turbine building uh, so TEPCO went to check the helicopter so which did the emergency landing on the second nuclear reactor um, but it seems like they after they did that uh, video check it didn't look like the helicopter made the damage to those uh, nuclear reactors building on the second nuclear reactors building So, according to TEPCO, on June 24th, Fukushima Daiichi nuclear reactor's uh, uh, radioactive water filtering system, they have reached its goal that they can remove the radiation level, they can remove the radioactive contamination to one hundred thousands so they have reached the goal on June 24th so uh, yeah so finally on June 24th the water filtering system of Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant start working. And according to Japanese government on June 24th, if the residents of Fukushima are going back to their houses within 20 km zone, they are they no longer have to wear the protective suits. 
it's because of the heat. It's getting hotter. If you wear the protective suits, it's going to be super hot. Uh, according to a uh, nuclear disaster counter agency team, from the previous temporary return to their house, they did not detect any high amount of the radiation. So, New Japan Nuclear Safety Commission also said that the people no longer have to wear the protective suits to go back to their house within 20 km zone of Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. The problem is, up to now, about 7,000 residents of Fukushima went, went back to their house to take up their belonging with the support of the Japanese government, police and fire department. However, 50 out of 7,000 people were suffering, uh, were uh, suffer from the heat stroke. And one 60-year-old guy were sent to the hospital because of the heat stroke. So as it gets hotter in summer, People cannot really stand for wearing the protective suits, radio, radiation protective suits. And also, uh, Japan Nuclear Safety Commission said the radiation level has went down, so it is kind of okay not to wear the protective suits. They, they are still going to wear the cap, mask, glove, and they need to cover their shoe. However, they no longer have to wear the protective suits to go back to uh, their houses. So, uh, according to uh, Yomiuri, on June 24th, the, guard the guardian parents, uh, parents of the uh, uh, Koriyama Fukushima went to uh, court to uh, to turn in the, the 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 claim that school needs to evacuate if the school has high amount of the radiation. So uh, 16 parents of 14 kids from uh, Fukushima, uh, Koryama, Fukushima turning the, uh, uh, you know, claim that many of the kids are will, according to the current reading, many area of the kids will be exposed to more than one millisiever per year of the radiation. So, uh, um, if the kids are going to keep staying the school within the area, they might have more chances to have a cancer. So uh, they want the uh, they wanna they want to send their kids to outside of Fukushima. However, the mayor of Koryama Fukushima uh, declined from the making the comment from it so so anyway this is the one example that the Japanese parents have a high concern towards their kids about the safety so according to TEPCO on June 24th they are getting ready to start injecting the nitrogen onto the second nuclear reactor for the first nitro first nuclear reactor, they have been injecting the nitrogen since the April 4th. However, second nuclear reactor, they had high amount of the humidity, so they couldn't start injecting the nitrogen because the worker couldn't go in there. 
However, because they have work to remove the uh, humidity by cleaning up the internal air of the second nuclear uh, power plant reactor, then they open up the door of the second nuclear reactor to uh, remove the uh, humidity. Now, workers were able to go in to the second nuclear reactor and then they are ready to inject the nitrogen. The reason why they need to put inject nitrogen is to prevent from hydrogen explosion, like we had. But this hydrogen explosion is for the inside of the、uh, you know, nuclear reactor and turbine. So, to, to prevent the further nitrogen explosion, they need to inject the,、uh, nitrogen into the、uh, nuclear reactor. They've, they've been already doing it for the first nuclear reactor since the April 6, but、uh, they, are getting, they were getting ready for, to inject the second nuclear reactor. So, according to、uh, NISA, Uh, National Industry、uh, Nuclear Industry Safety Agency on June 24th, they have disclosed all the reports that they receive from TEPCO on their website. So, uh, uh, you will be, if you go to NISA website, Nuclear Industry Safety Agency's website, you will, you will be able to see the 11,000 pages of their document that TEPCO has submitted to NISA. So, this, inc- this, uh, This, among this 11,000 pages report,、uh, it also includes the TEPCO's demand that TEPCO wanted to evacuate, TEPCO wanted to abandon the nuclear power plant itself. So,、uh, so, you will be able to see those.、Uh, The, those、uh, documents from Nisa's website. I think if you, you kind of need to、uh, be able to read the Japanese, though, I think. So,、um, this is the side story. So, because of all these k i n d of the mess of TEPCO and nuclear power plant, many of the stock, the, the, the price of the stock of all the Japanese major power electrical companies is getting cheaper, and many financial institutions, even the local government, actually owns power utility companies' stock. So, according to Yomiuri,、uh, Shizuoka Prefecture owns Chubu. Electric power company's stock. However,、uh, they lost about 30,、uh, 300,000.、Uh, no, they lost about 3 billion yen of the,、uh, their asset, which is about 40 million US dollar something, because the Chubu electric power company's stock price went down. So,、uh, finally, on June 27th, TEPCO said that they were going to start、uh, functioning the full、uh, water clearing, water processing facility after the test trial. And then and the, they're going to they're gonna start. Operating the, the, the water processing facility in a full throttle on June 27th. 
then also according to your Miuri uh, according to your Miuri the on June 27th they started a invest health investigation of the Fukushima residents so at uh, first a uh, couple residents of the Fukushima were sent to uh, a radiation in radiation institution Chiba prefecture to check their internal uh, radiation exposure so uh, Yeah, so Fukushima Prefecture start checking out the uh, health of the uh, other people. And uh, after they started a water filtering system of Fukushima nuclear power plant on June 27th, uh, they had to stop in about one and a half hour after they they really after the test trial, trial uh, they have to stop one and a half hour after they start the full throttle operation because they found one of the uh, pipe had a leaking had a leak so uh, so they had to stop it immediately after one and a half hour full throttle operation And according to NHK and Yomiuri, those uh, leak are coming from loosen bolt uh, and stuff. So they are they fixed and stuff. That's what they said on June twenty eighth. And in addition to the water filtering system stuff. TEPCO, Chubu Electric Company, and other many other electric company held the shareholder meeting yesterday. According so, according to NHK and Yomiuri, about nine thousand stock uh, holder attended a, a shareholders meeting. One of the shareholder suggested a minutes to include a uh, to dec to include the uh, goal company mission to decommission all the nuclear power plant however the minutes has been rejected by the 80 percent of the shareholder um, Anyway, so according to Nihon Genshiryoku Kaihatsu Nihon Genshiryoku Kaihatsu Kiko Yeah, Japan Atomic Energy Agency uh, They have conducted a uh, research of how many uh, people of the normal like residents are being exposed to the radiation and they said that the people the normal Japanese people who are not like typical worker on Fukushima Daiichi or self-defense personnel and stuff the only part of the uh, people were exposed to more than one one millisievert per hour uh, one millisievert of the radiation according to japan At atomic uh, energy agency so most of the uh, majority of the people japanese people are not exposed to more than one millisievert of the radiation. One millisievert of the radiation. 
those、uh, people who were exposed to more than one millisievert of the radiation is the people, the very small people who are located on the east side of Fukushima Prefecture, which is inside of the 20 kilometer zone. So the people who are outside of the 20 kilometer zone. They never been exposed to more than one millisievert of the radiation. That's, called, that's the one of the research results of Japan Atomic Energy Agency, according to Yomiuri's report. So, on the June 28th at 3 p.m., according to TEPCO, they have resumed working. They had resumed working on the water filtering system. Okay, sorry guys, I,、uh, I, I, uh, I had to turn the camera trouble. Camera trouble. Hold on a sec. Ha ha ha. Uh, you know,、uh, you were supposed to plug in the AC when you are in, indoor so that you don't have to worry about changing the battery. But apologize for the,、uh, the cutoff. But anyway, so on June 28th at 3 55 p.m., TEPCO resumed working on the water processing facility. And then Yeah. And then on June 28th, according to TEPCO, they have they started constructing the cover in the、uh, nearby bay. So, as you know, the Fukushima nuclear reactor's first and third, a,、uh, first and third、uh, nuclear reactor has blown away by hydrogen blast. And also, the first nuclear reactor also exploded.、Uh, then the, they, they got damaged. So, there's,、uh, th- there's no ceiling. So, it could be、uh, radiation could leak from that hole. And also, the rain comes in, and they ha- they, they'll have more contaminated water, radioactive contaminated water from the rain. So, in order to prevent、uh, of those stuff, TEFCO are going to build the temporary cover.、Uh, Uh, then they start the construction yesterday on June 28th. And then, so according to TEFCO, again on June 28th, finally they were able to start injecting. Nitrogen onto the second nuclear reactor of Fukushima Daiichi. So, again,、uh, they've been injecting the nitrogen、uh, first, they've been injecting the nitrogen onto the first reactor since the April 6th. 
then they were finally able to start injecting on the second nuclear reactor. Uh, the reason why they inject nitrogen into the reactor is to prevent the hydrogen blast. And the reason why the uh, Fukushima people have the 20 kilometers evacuation order is because of the fear of this hydrogen blast. So uh, according to TEPCO's original plan, they were supposed to be able to start injecting the nitrogen onto the onto the first to the third nuclear reactor by middle of next month so they need to start injecting the nitrogen onto the third third nuclear reactor as well however the radiation level of the nuclear uh, turbine nuclear reactor building of the third nuclear reactor are very high so a worker are having a hard time to go into the third nuclear reactor to start working on to 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 bring in the pipe and stuff to put the inject the nitrogen so they don't know when they can start injecting the nitrogen onto the third reactor. So, uh, uh, but according to NHK, uh, they and also other media, if uh, Japanese government says, I think uh, it could be Hosono-san, I think, if TEPCO were able to start uh, TEPCO were able to finish injecting nitrogen from first to third nuclear reactor, one, two, three nuclear reactor. The people of Fukushima start being able to go back to their houses. So, and then according to Japanese government on June 28th. They are going to use speedy system to uh, simulate the uh, the radiation exposure of the people of Fukushima. So speedy is the simulation system made by Japanese government to uh, predict the uh, radiation uh, sp sp spread uh, using supercomputer. So, uh, according to Japanese government uh, counter disaster team, they will spend about one month to calculate the uh, radiation spread from between March 12th to March 16th and they will try to calculate how much radiation that people of Fukushima were exposed to in between March 12th and March 16th. And according to Fukushima Prefecture, uh, Fukushima Prefecture is going is uh, uh, has disclosed the uh, automotive survey system to the press today, about three hours ago, according to um, Yomiuri newspaper. This uh, the mobile radiation survey system developed by Kyoto University. Uh, they install a decimeter, a radiation meter in the car, tagged with the GPS system, so they can monitor the radiation level every 10 seconds. And then they tag with the GPS so that uh, uh, they can monitor it. So according to uh, previously, Fukushima Prefecture were monitoring these data uh, 
you know, one by one, people go there, stand there, and measure it. But if they use this car, they can do more in depth reading at the large scale and much quicker. So, according to Fukushima Prefecture, they're going to have the 20 sets of this GPS and GPS radiation metering system,、uh, survey system, automotive、uh, survey system. And they are going to try to disclose more information about the radiation data in Fukushima Prefecture. Okay, okay,、uh, good night, Annette. And according to、uh, TEPCO on June 29th, today,、uh, they found a very, 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 very small hole s from the water filtering system. From the pipe that f e e d the clean water to the、uh, nuclear reactor. So,、uh, TEPCO stopped pouring the water at 11 o'clock this morning. They test it, they're testing if there's any other hole. So, Uh, yeah, so they, yeah, so they, their water filtering system stopped again today. So this is all I'm going to go to the、uh, NHK news、uh, going back. On June 24th, a、uh, radiation level of、uh, around the second nuclear reactor's uh, uh, water gate of the ocean, the, the amount of the iodine 131 went up a little bit, which was one cc, one becquerel per cc, which is high amount.、Uh, So,、uh, that's so they, they detect the uh, uh, they detect a little bit higher amount of the radioactive contamination in the ocean near the second gate. However, On June 27th, according to TEPCO, yesterday, the,、uh, they sample again the same location.、Uh, the amount of the iodine went down. So. So it went up in the one, so last couple of five days, the ocean contamination of the iodine went up, went up, went up, and yesterday it started going down again. So,、uh, you know, it's still, it's still there is some radioactive contamination and stuff, but,、uh, you know,、uh, that's. Pretty much it. Okay. So, according to the latest, no. Then, according to TEFCO, on June 23rd, they said that、uh, for the mental damage, they need to pay. Total of 88 billion yen, which is about over 900 million US dollar damage, mental damage payment to 150,000 people. So, uh, uh, according to uh, TEPCO, 
according to Japanese government、uh, committee, they suggested TEPCO to pay 100,000 yen, which is about 1200 US dollar per month to the people who had to evacuate. Long term, because of this, this、uh, Fukushima nuclear power plant and stuff. More detail of the amount are, I said it yes, last week's show. You can also check the last week's archive. But、uh, TEPCO did the calculation, and the total amount that they, TEPCO has to pay is 88 billion Japanese yen, which is about over 900 US. 900 million US dollars. So, a,、um, according to Japanese Police Department, as on June 28th, the total number of the deaths and missing tolls are 22,803. So the deaths are 15,506 people and missing are the missing toll are there are 7,297 people are still, still missing. So they found So they found 15,506 bodies, but they were only able to identify 13,822. So it's about,、uh, about 1,700 people they weren't able to identify.、Uh, then 7,000 people are missing. So, yeah. So that's what the latest numbers are. Okay. So that's pretty much it for this week's、uh, weekly update. Do you guys have any questions? Everyone, this is Katz from Yokoso News, yokosonews.com. Yokoso News is.、Um, Uh, Yokoso News is the online website to introduce Japanese culture in English. However, since the March 11th earthquake, I've been doing this、uh, emergency broadcast every week to keep you posted. And then, so now, next live cast, we're gonna do something special music for charity for Miyagi, presented by Lantern Music. By April Parkinson, and I will be, I am planning to live cast it for the show at 2 p.m. So don't miss it. And because this is the charity event, why don't I also help them? So you will be able to watch this show for free. However, I'm going to ask for a donation. I have lined up a couple options and I just I was so busy to、uh, take care of it. So, but、uh, if you have any question, you can send us an email as well. But,、uh, you know, now. Many people start forgetting about the disaster, so it is now our job to make sure to help people in North. So that's why, what, that's why we are doing this. So, uh, um, uh, yes, so make sure you watch the live cast. Or it will be archived. So you can decide to donate even after the show ended. Or actually, we might, we might, have, a, we might have a technical difficulty of the location. So、uh, we might not be able to do the live cast because we are going there without the rehearsal. 
so scary. But、uh, yeah, so people don't miss it. Next live cast, and I'll be in Tokyo. So、uh, you, I might do some tweet casting, and I'm planning to do、uh, next weekly live cast. I'm also going to do a special programming from Yokohama, Japan, as well. So uh, uh, don't miss it either. All right, any other question?、Uh, oh, just Penjan, Liz. Uh, James, thank you. I have been, I became 21 years old again. Barely legal to drink. So, any other questions? All right, so、uh, uh, okay.、Um, any other questions, everyone? Any other question, everyone? So. Jazz for blue. I saw Japanese could drink at any age as long as they don't get caught. <laughs> I'm not going to say anything, but legal drinking age is 20. But if you are 20 years old,、um, you won't be able to drink in the US and many other countries. So I say I'm 21. Yeah, it was my birthday yesterday. I mean, it's, it's in Japan, it's already June 29th. So,、uh, yeah, so if you feel like、uh, want to give me a birthday present, maybe you can,、uh, you can maybe start donating for the charity. No, 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 no. I mean, only, only if you want. So. All right, so、uh, that's the next、uh, live cast schedule. And then I don't know the time of my next emergency weekly update. I know I will be in Tokyo next Tuesday. So I may, I may, I may, I will have an irregular live cast、uh, schedule. Okay? So next week.、Uh, so.、Uh, Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Just for Blue. Thank you. How am I doing, Just a Cap? I'm, I'm doing fine. I'm doing good. So, any, any other q u e s t i o n about the disaster update? Risa, thank you. So, Risa, thank you very much. Oh. So. Yeah. So that's pretty much it for the、uh, drug. Our, our, our thing. Okay. James Wilson, did they ever remove that huge ferry off the top of the building? Yes, they did. So、many people wanted to reserve uh, that, uh, that site. However, I,、uh, they end up removing that. How are the ocean faring with the radiation? What do you mean, ocean faring? You mean that are they measuring the、uh, radiation level at the ocean fair? 
fairy. Well, that's what you mean.、Uh, well, according to Ministry of Environment, they've been testing 135 beach. And then,、uh, you're talking about ocean contamination? Uh, yeah, I mean,、uh, information is available on the,、uh, you know, on the website, available on the website too. So, just for blue. So, any, any other question? Otherwise, I'm going to conclude this week's、uh, emergency update. And.、Uh, I mean, you know, I,、uh, I, I'm not, you know, to be honest with you, Jess for Blue,、uh, before I start this emergency broadcast, as, as, you, I, as I keep explaining to you guys, I want, I, you know, one of the core m i s s i o n of the Yokosu News is that I want to make sure that you will be informed. In English, in case of the disaster. So, this emergency broadcast dedicated to the people who live in Japan and who cannot really speak Japanese. Because uh, Japanese uh, people are the、um, Japanese people, you know, we Japanese speak Japanese. So, most of the latest information are provided in Japanese. But、uh, I was living in the US. During the 9 11. So,、uh, w- whenever I received the latest information about the 9 11 during that time, it was in English, it was not Japanese. So,、uh, I, I know how people would feel like in, when the disaster happened in Japan because main, mainly information is provided in Japan. So, so Yokosu News is doing this.、Uh, Helping you guys to provide the latest information. So, I was expecting to provide earthquake, tsunami,、uh, you know, typhoon information because I, I was pre- preparing to, I was preparing those knowledge to be able to provide. However, you know, to be honest with you, a、uh, radiation, <laughs> I never expected that. This、uh, nuclear incident is going to happen. So, I'm actually learning the radiation threat as we go. Like, I learned so much last three months. So, uh, uh, you know what? I am, I am doing my best to bring you the information. So,、uh, I can only trust, I can only. Trust the information coming out from the media, and also I'm monitoring the Japanese independent media too. And I'm also checking Japanese government website, so I'm just reading a uh, uh, I, I'm just reading those information to you guys, and then again, I'm just saying to you that. You should believe in Japanese government as much as you believe in your own government. You should believe in the main, Japanese mainstream media's information as much as you believe in mainstream media in your country. And you should also believe in the freelance, you know, independent media as much as you believe in your independent media. So, uh, uh, yeah, you know, you, you ask me how fair they are. Like,、uh, tip, you know, when, for example, people ask me that if,、uh, if I think that if,、uh, what do I. What do I think? People sometimes ask me what do I think about if TEPCO are hiding information or not.、Uh, in my personal opinion, I think TEPCO are kind of doing their job in a way, but this is their first time to have this kind of the disaster. So、uh, even TEPCO, they don't know what they're doing. It's like they don't know what they, they are, they don't really know. 
they are they are doing much, but they are responsible though, you know. So so uh, um, uh, they have to be responsible, but uh, you know the human being are only capable so much, uh, you know. So uh, uh, yeah, I said that. I think TEPCO are not really hiding the information. They just don't know what to do. So that's why you only should trust TEPCO as much as you trust your power utility company in your country or something. So, yeah. Cool, everyone. Genetic, uh, just, uh, just for blue. Thank you. Uh, 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 Risa, what is the music? Uh, it's a uh, uh, royalty free music by uh, uh, a uh, Kevin, Kevin McLeod. Uh, so it's I, I found his website, Kevin McLeod. Um, it's the, his name, he is letting everybody to use his music for free as long as I say his name so I say I say his name at the beginning of the show thank you very much everyone so um, is there any question is there any question so 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 uh, I'm, I'm saying that uh, you know uh, Kevin Maclow, K K K E V I N M A C L O A D. Incompete dot com or something. I have to look it up. It's it's in some of the archive of the YouTube. I think I put his name on it too. In in my past archive, so. Oh, actually, I do have one here. Yeah, K E V I N M A C L E O D. Kevin McLeod. That's the guy's name that I'm using. Hey, Ben, what's up? All right, everyone, so it is time. I'm getting hungry. I have a curry left over from yesterday that I ate on my birthday. So I have a birthday curry left over that I want to eat. It's already 2 p.m. I hadn't had my lunch. So uh, unless, but, uh, unless you have a, my question, uh, you will, uh, I will stay on a little bit one more minutes or so so people uh, I again we never been to the location before so I never tested a network connection so it could be it could be we might have we might not be able to do a live cast there but next live cast is the music concert music concert a live cast coming up so uh, and then I'm going to I'm going because I'm going to although I'm going to broadcast for free but this is the charity concert so I'm going to ask you to help our effort to donate their their effort music for charity for uh, music for charity for Miyagi uh, uh, produced by uh, April Parkinson, Music Lantern .net. You can go to Lantern. No, I'm sorry. You can go to Lantern Music .net for their more information of what they do. So I want Yokoso News to join their effort. All the money is going to first going to pay my expense to do this live cast. And then I really want to go to uh, North Japan to uh, to I really want to go to North Japan to see it in on my eyes. I really want to try to do live cast or recorded cast. Uh, so that's why I'm doing this. I'm gonna join the uh, concert. Uh, then currently, all the expense. 
of this charity concert are coming out of my own pocket. And then I can only do so much. But this is the,、uh, you know, I actually wanted to do it anyway, even though, even though I wasn't able to, I'm not able to collect enough amount of the donation, that's okay. Because、um, disaster will keep happening. So we will have to、um, do charity concert more often anyway. So this is also the practice for me to,、uh, to, uh, to, for the, get, to get ready for the disaster next time. So,、uh, yeah, so if、uh, anyway, so I'm waiting for your、uh, yeah, so Ben, where can I find Kyoto radiation level info? Kyoto or Tokyo, Ben? Which one?、Uh, you should go to Ministry of Education, MEXT, M E X T dot G O dot J P. Then you, should, you will be able to click the English link. Then they have a list of the old prefecture radiation reading. So,、uh, all right.、So、that's.、Uh, that's what. It is. Alright, everyone.、Uh, any other question? No? No? Ben? No? You, you cool? You cool? You cool is my question. So, next week,、uh, so people don't forget our live cast music for charity concert coming up. Looking for your donation because I want to continue doing this. You know, and、uh, I think it's go also going to help、uh, by sharing how we overcome the disaster. I think it's also going to be、uh, our knowledge for the future It, when, when the disaster happens in your own country, whether it's typhoon or earthquake or tornado or、uh, I don't know what else. But, you know, more experience that we can share, we can apply to disaster in the next level. I, you know, in my opinion, I think we keep saying that, oh, this tsunami earthquake was beyond our expectation. You know, I think、uh, disaster is all about beyond expectation. So,、um, Um, because、uh, the one of the reasons why I was able to come on March 11th when the disaster happened,、uh, I already knew that all, for, for the first couple hours when disaster happened, I already knew that this disaster is going to be huge. Uh, but uh,、um, But I remember the、uh, I remember what I experienced from 1995 Hanshin earthquake 16 years ago. And I did research what happened in 1996 Hanshin Kobe earthquake. 
Uh, the only the problem is I don't have enough resources to translate those documents that I read in Japanese to English. So it is also long time. You know, I need I need to spend long time to uh, translate, or I need help. To translate those、uh, resources from Japanese to English, but anyway,、um, I read those what what they experience in、uh, Osaka in 1995. Then I was able to because I re- did the research before March 11th when the uh, when the uh, when when the March 11th hit. I always try to remember what happened the day of and second day, even though it was 16 years ago. I still remember the first couple of days of what happened. You know, first day always. We don't have information. You know, of course, the lifeline is always cut off and no information. And day after day, we re- we start rebuilding all the information and we needed to act quick. So、uh, first day, you know the the trick that I learned. You need to run away if you have to run away quick. Then once you run away, you have to wait. So that's what I learned. And and then most important thing is that you have to come. But I was able to act、um, uh, calm, and I was able to. Uh, I I knew where to look. I knew where to go to find the right information at the right time. Uh, 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 you know, I was kind of preparing and I was reading those, researching those information. So I think I'm hoping that we can we can do the same from this disaster. Because 1995 Hanshin earthquake in Japan was just earthquake. We didn't have tsunami disaster, so we can learn the tsunami disaster this time.、Uh, of yes, we did have a Sumatra tsunami disaster, but、uh, this time actually we thanks to everybody having the video camera. We have more scientific evidence to be able to investigate the mechanism of the huge disaster. You know, the Indonesian Sumatra tsunami. It, it caused a huge damage. We could learn from it too, but we didn't have enough scientific、um, evidence. But because it happened in Japan, we could gather.、Uh, Lots of scientific evidence, and this can pass it on to the next generation and stuff. So uh, uh, yeah, so that's、uh, that's why. And then also, you know, Japan. I live in Japan. You know, Japan is the、uh, disaster country. And then also、uh, my second home. I I I think my second home is in Los Angeles, California. That area is also earthquake region too. It happened Northridge, San Francisco earthquake. I mean, earthquake happened in the area too. So, if I learn, if I was able to provide the information, no matter how small number of people watching this show at this moment,、uh, I think it's going to help a little bit more people. So. Yeah. So.、Uh... Yeah. Just a cap. Nova on PBS. Yes. No. PBS Nova was able to produce that、uh, program because、uh, Japanese TV station filmed those footage. So.、Uh, um... So that's why、um, that's why PBS were able to produce that program using Japanese TV stations footage. So 
yeah so uh, that's uh, that's what's my intention of continuing this uh, disaster information and also you know I'm asking all of you to come and enjoy the life of Japan come to travel to Japan and stuff the person who's going to encourage coming to Japan to travel I think they you know you must know how to protect my guest so uh, that's also one of the reasons why I want to continue this disaster coverage you know so this is this this was already our first mission since the beginning of the Yokoso news when I started last year so uh, yes so anyway um, that's uh, pretty much it so uh, uh, can I finish now everyone so I'm getting hungry so uh, yeah Yeah, thank you, Liz. So, uh, yeah, genetic. Yes, you, uh, you will. We will. Uh, we will. You know, you sh We when we when you come, we should uh, meet up. I I receive a couple email from someone. You know, who are coming to Japan and stuff too. So, yeah, you know, it's good to have some reunion stuff. All right, yeah, curry time, Zen. Thank you very much. So everyone, thank you very much for watching. This is Katz from Yokoso News. Yokoso News is the online website to introduce Japanese culture in English so that you can understand Japanese culture more. However, since March 11th earthquake, I've been switched part of my program to pro uh, provide the up-to-date information, weekly in-depth up-to-date information that you wouldn't normally hear from the major English media about the uh, tsunami, earthquake, and Fukushima nuclear incident. So uh, I'm not really providing English what the English media says because you guys understand English anyway. Why do I have to also introduce the uh, other media's information? My role, I can understand Japanese. There are many Japanese media, Japanese investigator, Japanese freelance reporter are trying to uh, investigate this nationwide in Japan. Those information tends to be the latest. So uh, I'm here to help you to translate what the Japanese people are saying so that you understand what's going on the latest of Japan. But, you know, I, I cannot do it every week. Uh, so I'm doing it. I mean, I, I cannot do it every day because of the uh, uh, resources, lack of the resources. So I switch back to weekly. Uh, I'm doing it every Tuesday night at 8 p.m. However, it's been irregular time because it's getting towards the summertime. So uh, I need to get ready for the summer special programming for our regular program. But also this leads to uh, this disaster effort as well, which include music for charity livecast happening this weekend. People, please don't miss it. The information is going to be available on yokosonis.tv as well. And I will be looking for the donation. I kind of keep asking. Haha, <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, so that I can keep doing this as well. Alright, so uh, now it's time to uh, eat my curry. So uh, I, will, uh, I will talk to you guys later thank you very much uh just the cap risa ben genetic fruit cake leads zen uh who else uh, lately who made a comment james uh james just for blue all right so i will see you guys sunday afternoon japan standard time 
or、uh, next Tuesday, but the next weekly、uh, update, I don't know, it's going to be at the very random time because uh, uh, I will be in Tokyo. It, oh, people, don't forget to follow us at Yokosu News on Twitter. Or like us at Yokos News on Facebook because I will keep posting update there. Alright, l everyone. Thank you very much. Bye bye.